Hey, hi, so I'm Lakeham, everyone, Ramadan Mubarak. Um, so today we are for Ramadan and we're going, we will be making a little Ramadan counter. If you can see, this is a ruler and it's a, a foot ruler, but on one side you have inches, this side, and on the other side you have centimeters. So what we're interested is in the centimeter side. So if you see, you have a number of one to 30. Let's see if I go the right way around. So you've got over here, so wrong way around. So we have the number one at the top, you can see over there, and that goes all the way down to 30. So the idea is on the first of Ramadan, that's your first fast. And as the day goes on, or as the you know the days go on in Ramadan, you move the counter down as such. So by the time you get to the 15th one or uh, etc., you just move it down until you get right to the bottom when it's Eid. So this is a really fun Ramadan counter and we're going to do a quick little tutorial on this and uh, I'll show you how to make it. Right, so in your craft kit over here, you should have a ruler, you should have some beads as well, uh, about five pipe cleaners, uh, two popsicle sticks and two little geometric stars. Um, you'll also need to have this just a pen or a pencil, just so that we can make the little twirls with the um, with the pipe cleaners. So the first thing we're going to start, to, we're going to do, we're going to glue the stars onto the pops, popsicle stick. So you will also need to have um, wood glue or runny glue. In my case, I'm going to use a hot glue gun, as you can see, and we are going to just stick the back of the popsicle the stick. The popsicle stick to the back of the stop. So I'm going to go ahead and do this one. So just get a bit of glue and we're just going to, when this heats up, we will just put a bit of glue on the end. And here we go, it's starting to come out. Here we go. Um, I would use hot glue only because it just dries really quick. But if you don't have that, then just simple Elmer's glue, but you're going to have to wait for it to dry. So right now you can see. So once that's done, it should be secure and you'll get a little bit of glue that uh, squeezes out from behind. Um, so that's fairly stuck down. So we're gonna do cool sticks. We're gonna just put a bit of glue on the back of this as well. Such. And then we're going to glue it on the back like that. You want to kind of line them up so the length is about the same. Okay, so once that's dry, this is nearly dry, it should be quite sturdy. So then we're going to just take our ruler, as you can see here. It doesn't matter which side you're going to use, we just want to make a little clamp with the two stars. So you're going to take your um, your two uh, popsicle sticks and line them up. So you have the two stars lined up and you have, uh, have your uh, pops popsicle sticks as well lined up. And you just take one of the colors and we're just gonna wrap this round. This should be there to hold your sticks. So there's no glue required for that part. You just, just wanna wrap it around enough times just so that it's firm enough and makes a clamp and you're able to move it up and down, okay? Once that's done, we'll get another color. I'm just gonna turn it, I'm just gonna pinch it in the middle to get the center, just so that it can be about the same, same length. And I'm just gonna wrap it around once or twice, like such. And then I'm gonna do the same with the other ones. So I'm just gonna get the center, so that are roughly about the same size. And then, Going to wrap that one round too. You can probably wrap it round and then just twist it just to make it a little secure so they don't. So what you're going to end up having, like a, you're going to have like little arms that stick out, a little octopus arms. You don't have to use all of your pipe cleaners. You can use three, four, or as many as you want. I am going to use, I think I have three here. All right, so once that's done, just twist it. As you see, all right. Now we're gonna make the fun, it looks like a spider right now. So we're gonna make it a little bit more fun. And we're gonna get a 
pen or a pencil and then we're just going to wrap it around to get the nice coil design like this and then you pull it out and pull that out slightly and same with the next one I'm just going to wrap it around oh. now if it falls off it's fine mine did come off it might actually be easier if you just take it off the ruler and you just wrap it around and you, and you do the following. So wrap the pipe cleaners around the pen or a pencil. Nearly done. So it's a very quick craft. I'm gonna do it to this one. And then I think I have two more to go. One there. Let's do the light blue. Now you can have fun and do as many colors as you want you can even paint the star and on one side you can write Eid and on the other side you can write day of Ramadan so you can paint it or you can leave it all wood you can even paint the ruler if you wanted to so now I have these little squiggles just pop it back on now it's up to you which side you want to put your popsicle stick I'm going to do it so that the star actually lands on the number over here, if you can see. So I'm going to do it. So right now I've got it on 17. Now just feed some little beads on the end just to kind of make it look pretty. Mm -hmm. Like such. Give it a bit more layering and dimension to your craft. Now, if you want, you, like I said, you can. You can use, um, if you have a larger ruler, that might work. And you can even hang this up. Um, you can hang it up or you can leave it on the table. You can put little um, clips to make it stand up. And we're almost done. So get the last bead in. And there we go. Let's just arrange our little design. Let's one bead short. Let me grab one more. <clears throat> Let's put it on there. All right, so there we go. We got our Ramadan counter. So now we can slide it up and down to the corresponding day that you're fasting. So we have the first one up here. Now this ruler has a hole in there. If you want, if you don't have a hole in your ruler, you can simply put some string on the back with a bit of tape. And then you can just slide with the little handle up and down to the day that you're going to fast. And that's how you make a little simple Ramadan counter. Well, thank you for watching. <laughs>